Okay, folks. We're back. We just saw some wild stuff. Uh, we fought, we fought. We fought a cursed demigoddess in a field of purple sand. We saw a general. Take a syringe to the hip, but be totally fine. There's a really cool, uh, there's a really cool, like, person in a cloak. Might be like the, um, the purple haired lady we saw earlier. I don't know. There's stuff happening, but we're at one concern E. We're at one concern EA. Uh, Electronic Arts has opened a one concern, uh, like, um, office. So I guess they're making games over here. Oh, East. One concern East. I'm sorry. Okay. And yeah. Let's just go. Yep, shuttle platform's over there. Rocket manufacturing, because that's where you manufacture a rocket. We're just gonna take the elevator. There's a bunch of eyes there. <gasps> Aha! See? There's half a plant in the wall. Why would there be half a plant in the wall? Oh, the chemical contra- oh, chemicals are there, at least. I got a key. Is there a giant mass that's gonna follow me very angrily at some point? Hey, Ivory. Rocket launch. Rocket launch. Okay, surgical research and clinic. All right. Hi. Okay, everyone's real uh, resistant here. So what if I just left? Bye. Here we go. Oh no, I can't go up here because of... I'm gonna get mad every single time that I can't climb up here. The fights of- oh no! Elra, what are you doing? All my senders are transcenders. <laughs> Hello, Kevin. So, recent events have brought to our attention. <laughs> know the power of mother. Hey, Cambrian. Hi. Uh, stuff's getting real in the final, like, act, maybe, of Iconoclast. I don't know if this is the last act, but it, it, it feels like it. <laughs> Please, I'm, I'm trying to have a, a monologue here. I'm kind of far from home right now. This, like, stuff is happening. I'm not sure if you've noticed, but... Incidentally, I had an OC who was sort of like a, um... Uh, like an, um... sort of like a cowboy who could see the future and that is very close to verbatim one of the things he said like when all the roads lead to death you pick the one with the most positive outcomes i've even forgotten his name all right elro probably best you didn't 
climb into this and then get turned into goo. Hi. Boop. I'm gonna peek up here. Anything? Oh, okay, there's just... Oh yeah, this brings me back. Hey, buddy! What's up? I'll absolutely give you my autograph. Okay. I kind of like the tweaks I have, honestly. I could make one of these, though. And this seems like it might be important at some point, so I guess I could make a few. I definitely want to make another one of these, though. I really like these. I guess I guess we're cool. Thank you. Hi. Beep. And then the black hole went Let's go to the uh, purple question mark. It's my favorite bar. What I got? I never dive roll. Let's just go faster. we'll come back to that other place later. Ooh, that's a neat city. Again, this... Do we need to answer your questions three? Gatekeeper Progenarian Pete. Listen, buddy, please have respect for folks with prosopagnosia. I will rely on more hints than the things that can easily be counterfeited. I totally do get his point, though, that, like, I don't know, you just could be anyone. Prove to me you're not the fool. Summon up a swimming pool. You like use your powers. Show me that you're a royal. Mm. <laughs> Just let magic man shimmer fingers in. That's so good. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm so glad I get to actually, like, tell you what I think of you. Uh, 
I'm, I'm reading a book. Wait, by the color... Hmm. Are you still here? <laughs> Thank you for the hint. You okay, buddy? Oh, you're shooting at me. I'm sorry. I didn't. I couldn't quite parse your gesture there. restaurant called restaurant where the hell is Tony the ball pit bar clothing oh I love to go to clothing it's like no name just decided to like brand an entire city Please do not touch the giant glowy thing. Oh, there's a car. Mm. Oh. Electronics, come here to buy your produce. We kind of messed up with the name requisition form, but hey, we're here. Can't change it now. Whoops, sorry, sorry. I also want to go to a ball pit bar. That sounds great. Story of me. Get right on it, ma'am. Speak. Thank you, Dizzy Hippos. Crafty little thing. It's a good thing the moon is exploding. Hmm. 
Oh, it's a heater. Aww. I want to talk to your face. There's a new Ivory Reborn? What? So, no bell. Okay. But there's new folks. Capitalism. <laughs> oh yeah, the weird smell quakes. Clothing. thing here. Kind of like a little thing on wheels. And oh, nope, sorry, just need to muscle on through. Bye. It, this game changes a lot. <gasps> Mother's Parade Float? Mom seems into it. And we're just sitting down like, ah, uh, gosh sake. Hmm. 
Starworm, buddy! Come on! Come on! Throw us one! Yeah, yeah, come on! That's kind of harsh. Holy crap. That's pretty cool. Oh, I guess I guess we're okay, I guess we're fine. Alvaro's just kind of like I'm just gonna walk around in the background here. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Punching you out is what I'm doing. Really would have liked to grab that heart. Thank you. Punch. Oh, maybe maybe don't actually crush us with a giant boulder. Bye.
Why is Rock Kitten exploding? Uh, there is like kind of a weird little dash, but we have to, um, I have to equip it and I haven't. And either way, I've been so damaged, all of my tweaks are gone, so. I just, just kicked myself and my way in, I guess. Hey, what's up, folks? Yeah, I see some, see some faces I recognize in the crowd. Let me, let me be honest with you here, so. There we go. Yeah, Chrome's... <sighs> That's still super creepy. Yeah, no, but uh, yeah. So the thing about Chrome is that he kicked, he kicked a man off a cliff when we first saw him. That's not, that's not like good person behavior. As loath as I am to just refer to people as good people and bad people, when you just kick a man off a cliff after having an interesting discussion about philosophy, that kind of sets the stage for the kind of person you are. Hello, normal kitty. Let's save. Yeah, if like, if, if did she make a kid, a giant kitty? Because there's just a small kitty here. A little small kitty. Elmer's just seen a lot. Well, let's go talk to the giant godworm in the sky, I guess. Hi. Yeah, sorry, I just need to get through here. I'll make an exception for you, because... Yeah. Thank you. Oh. 
Invincibility? Oh, come on! Okay. This... Fine, fine, fine. Yeah, no, this is... Alright, well... Well, let's go talk to God again. Big. Giant snake, snake-shaped jerk. Which game was it? Uh, Metroid Returns is the game that really ticked me off because um, combat started being just like this with enemies who were invincible to all of your weapons and except one or had like one specific thing you needed to do to be able to hurt them. And so combat became this giant chore of always like, okay, this one I need to like, oh, thanks for the follow. For this one, I need to do this thing, and then for this one, I need to do this other thing, and then, like, it's just, it, was, it got to be such a giant chore, I would just stop, like, and stop just, like, fighting enemies entirely. Okay, um, hey folks, how do you beat these enemies? I'm willing to accept any and all tips right now. I know, now like the big electrified purple guys, I have no clue, nothing I do ever hurts them. These jerks, we can just bounce back the grenades and then it's an RNG game of hoping that they will actually use the single attack you can reflect back at them. Is there more to it? Swap away the big purple guys. Okay. Oh, 
By the way, this is the consequence of um, introducing us to enemies we can just skip every time. We don't learn how to fight them because because it, be, it it's very clear that they're a hassle to fight, so we just don't. Uh, Digi Hippos, please do not use um, that emote in my channel. There we go. In the end, the optimal thing was just to not actually fight them. Oh. Good old mural Ryu. I kind of want to learn what the Star Worms deal is. No, buddy, you're, you're fleeing with... Mm. The accountants are upset. Big mood. She really wanted this thing to be done. Oh gosh, someone just... Okay, yeah, someone... Gosh, that's... that's morbid. Anyone else noticing the painting in the back there? Hmm. Interesting. Who is this? Oh, is that the dude who was on the other statues? Sorry, sorry for existing.
Did you just... Was... Hmm. I do not know what the iconoclasm is. Also, I would have liked to know who the person was in the chair. Maybe not? Yep. Right, that thing was a binary solution, right? It kind of like, kind of, I actually have one of those in my bathroom right now. It's like, uh, like a drain unclogger. I've tried a bunch of different ones that never really do the thing, but the one that really works is the one that the bottle is actually like two bottles locked together. So it's actually two liquids. And when you pour them down the drain, they actually like mix together and that causes the reaction. But since the reaction happens while it's going down the drain, it's more powerful. Anyway. Tolo was saying something important. Oh, jeez. Folks sure lose their religion real fast. Oh, right, right, when Royal chucked the thing, there was a red thing that left, so did that alert the Starworm? Oh, iconoclasm, the social belief in the importance of the destruction of icon. Iconoclasm. Okay, yeah, okay, okay, I see it. Interesting. 
Kitty's just, Kitty's just like taking a nap. Oh, we were just like, um, destroying some icons up top. That's a thing. Can I go into this? No, okay. Woof. Right, okay. Be careful of this thing. She says before running into another one. Buddy, you're upset. Stuff's happening. It's real bad, but you know. Sometimes we just need to, like, get the heck out of Dodge. Bye. Please move. Thank you. Oh, I missed some map parts over there. Oh. Well. Oof, got it. Uh, this is... Hmm. Yep, that's me. I'm probably wondering how I got myself into this situation. again. That was Buddy. <laughs> Just like a bunch of bunch bunch of trucks going like mm, like no concern. No concern. Like Hey, what if the starworm came down and he was angry? One concern. One concern. Yeah, let's just go. Hi, what's up? Oh, I brought the kitty! Aww. Mina brought the kitty along.
Oh. Yeah, hanging out in space. Hmm. Oh, hey, we've done that before. I review a baby fastest rocket in the wherever this is, actually. Mina just wants to go home. Don't... Come on, we could go to the moon! Yep, yep. I like Tegan. Bye, kitty. You take care, okay? Aww. Thank you. I sure I like the decorations. Oh right. <laughs> he's he's got he's got a key card. <laughs> Rocket time. You'd think more people would be here, like, just trying to get to that rocket, but I don't mind. Oh, there we go. All right, panic mode bastion orders, everybody. Oh, yeah, there's purple hair lady. Men to leave. Hmm. Those some pretty good looks, I, I gotta say. 
Man, the leaf looks like really, really cool. Yuck. And for England. Hello! How are you? This is not the counter hardcore slide. It does not make you invincible. Double shot. Oh no! You have a really cool, like, yeah, like bodysuit and sleeveless jacket. That is such a look. That's a heck of a look. Gosh, I, w I want, I want that look at some point. Like, like style goals. I'm just going to keep like smacking her in the face. Oh, there we go. That works. That works real well.
Ah, always right at the end. I want to throw you into the electric beds. Oof! Just like that. <laughs> that that was that was pretty adorable. <laughs> yeah, it was a real close fight. Oh, it can't actually go down here. Okay. Fine, door has ticket go. I don't even know what the heck I'm supposed to do there. Okay, if this puzzle can be cheese, please let me know how, because I don't want to just spend 25 minutes moving blocks around. How are you even supposed to do it with five blocks? Gosh, thank you so much.
Yeah. There we go. As long as it doesn't reset. How the heck were you even supposed to do the last two? Yeah, honestly, how the heck do you do the last two? Is it just like you can like, do a repeat jump more, like, enough to just do it? I know, but there's not enough blocks for you to, like, stand next to them. If, if this game looks like your jam, and you don't mind the parts that I am minding a lot, then by all means go, it's real cool, the controls are great, it's like, it's a fun adventure, it's just, there are parts of it that make me very angry. Because that's, you know, the, the kind of player I am. I like that they give us a quick way back. You actually wouldn't like me when I'm angry. I'm like, I don't like me when I'm angry. Hey buddies, what's up? A good run, you know. Hmm. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, this bad. knocking you out folks I'm just Not sure what I did, but... <laughs> Yay! Okay, if you... If I would have shot the bomb things, it would have KO'd her. Okay. Brute forcing boss fights in unintended ways. That's what I do. Just <sighs> take a nap. Cool. Okay, listen. Yeah, stop that attic. Yeah. Strong mouse. Stubborn mouse. Oh, geez. Still got your sword, buddy. See my every move. Gooey eyes watching me. Gooey eyes watching me, watching me. Bonk.
Hi, birdies. That is some weird cloud formations going on there. Hi. Bye. Hi, Mom. I don't know those things. You know, Mom, why don't you make like a tree and slowly grow while helping others grow close to you? Just saying. Hi, Rambo Pliskin. Guess we're gonna fight. Oh, come on. <laughs> Okay, yeah. Oh. Oh, just missed you. There you go. Thank you for standing still right there and not moving an inch. I really appreciate it. Why are you putting it in the sky? I wish I would have one hit this guy. I would have been like the best fight. Fuck. Now I've heard there's greater good stuff before. You may think you're original, and not not the most original. Oh wow. Okay. Sorry, kind of missed your pattern there. That one I got. Your sword kind of, okay. I really like the whole, like his, his, eventually he starts throwing his sword like a knuckleball. That's a nice touch. Hey, come on, what? I actually got it, but I still got hurt? Didn't duck fast enough, well. I hope you like replaying this entire fight.
Actually, they fight so they can survive. Furthering the species is just a uh, chaos at work. Still calling like I'm calling bull crap on the fact that I deflected the sword but still took damage. That's no. again. Making him so angry. Ha! <laughs> Elro. Elro finishes him off. Star worm, star worm. The tone of this game is real weird, but it's interesting. You don't really get to see a lot of this. There's not even a map. We're off the map. Here, there be dragons. Peek. Worth it. Worth it to get the peek. Take me to the top, top, top. Yeah, I'm a mechanic, it's what I do. Right, right.
Ow. Like I said, you don't need the whole health bar, you just need a little bit at the end. It's <laughs> all you need, really. You're good. As long as you have that little bit. My, your one concern. <laughs> Aww. You know, maybe Harlot shouldn't be using as an insult.
I had to try. Couldn't really like just go without trying at least once. Cause that's not who I am.
Oh, jeez. Thank you for the tip. The charge shot really does work well.
Just use the arcade cabinet and then go. Please stop talking. Hey, you made it. You don't know her either, you giant jerk. Hmm. It's the 17th moon rocket. Kind of run out of things to say, silent protagonist.
Please don't turn into a creepy DM conversation. Oh, we made it. Awesome. Let's take a nap on this couch. No, okay. Gosh, the mood up there kind of got messed up. Also, I really like the very, very squarish world. Welcome to Midway, pupils! Emmeth Darling. Yep. Iceling Farrier. B Block Rock. Oh wow, okay, there's actually the, that's the name of a person. Oliver Shard. Joseph Glass. Mother. Progeny Royal. Uh She had a place. Who is B again? Also, I love the fact that, yeah, you have lower gravity. It feels like it, at least. Star Worm! Oh, B. Blockrock was one of the four CEO types. Ah, oh, okay, okay. I have no clue what's going to happen. Hi, Starworm. Got one of those blue things on the side of... Yeah.
Right, we're all doing the thing he does. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's real bad. That's like this, yeah, um... Yeah. And this, folks, is, um... Can I, can I actually go down here? Is it like... No, it's just... Okay. This, folks, is why toxic masculinity is bad. Because, like... See how, how quickly he turned from, like, Cool, yes, we're doing this for the humanity, to, like, No, you need to answer me! I'm like, I'm, I'm important, like... Like, we live in fear of, like, someone snapping like this, which is why, you know, you gotta be, you gotta be careful who you hang around with. Royal is a bunch of people I have known, and they are all super scary. And I live in the hopes that, you know, people can get better. Oh, this is bad. Oh, jeez. Nope. Like, this can't be the answer. That is super messed up. Yeah, there's no blocks to grab. That's kind of sad. But yeah, like, Royal is, like... Royal is part of the, like... Part of the reasons why there's, like, folks from, like, my hometown and school and such that I'm just, like, not in a hurry to, you know, talk to. Because, like, yeah, there's folks like this who are, like... <sighs> Saviorb. The Saviorb. It's the Savior Orb. It's the Saviorb. Oh, that was a big load of nothing. Hi. But yeah, like, yeah, like I, I have known like folks from like way in the past and like, oh, they're, they're like, they're fine, they're nice until something doesn't go their way and then they turn and they get real scary and I'm kind of like, I've done my best to like keep that kind of person out of my life and like, it, I, 
I hope folks like this, like, provided they're not left stranded on an, a decompressing space station on the moon, can, like, grow and change and get better. But I've, like, kind of made my peace with the fact that sometimes I, I don't have to be the one to do it. And that it's actually safer for me to maintain some distance. Hmm. Oh, thanks, Dizzy. Me too. Ooh. That said, I'm glad I feel safe around all you folks. <laughs> oh, the worm. Oh, oh, gosh. Okay. <laughs> right, what happened with that? Mm. I like that they get to reuse that hug animation. I like how the Savior orb, um, like little, the two little squares and the bottom like uh, gap kind of look like a mouth. So it looks like the Savior orb is going like... It's a happy Savior orb. Savior orb is happy to save you. That Savior orb like did its purpose. It's like real, real pleased with itself. Good job, little Savior orb. Great. Yes, that crash involved me some. Also, the kitty. The kitty. Also, thank you for the follow. The kitty's fine. The kitty's fine, folks. <laughs> yes, sir. If you can see this face, I saved you. Great and monstrous space hose. That's so good. Mm. Yep, that's what I figured.
I can't actually go downstairs because my the only way to interact. Oh no, I just literally can't go downstairs. Well, I'm sorry. I stayed with you for a little bit. Kitty's okay, but I gotta go. down here though, right? Ah, oh, never mind. Oh, hello. Whoops. I'm glad I got the mother. Impact zone. Oh, hey, this is the, the part that's left of the... the thing. Heck are you? separates them. Yeah, okay, we can I can probably do like if there's like post game stuff, I can probably do a optional boss run at some point. Yeah, there's ghosts. Bye, ghost. Oh gosh, those.
Okay, uh, hey, you're, you're getting real annoying. Hmm. Yeah, like, I'm, I've entered, um... I've entered end of the game mode, which means I'm now ready to end the game. And the longer the game keeps going like this, the more, like, impatient I'm gonna get. Like, um... I guess, like, some, some games kind of, like, get, like, kind of a show. Show their hand a little bit as to, like, when, when, uh, the ending is coming. And some of them, like, take a bit too long to exit. It's like Bioshock, I think the first Bioshock at some point, um... Like, I think the first Bioshock, at some point you kind of like get, okay, this is it. But then you realize you have like a whole other section to go before you actually reach the end and like, oh, this is actually like taking way longer than I thought it would. Like I was ready to go. I was ready to kind of like Oh right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The emotional high of the black fight is kind of getting diluted here. Okay, so there we go. That's how we Okay. This is how you exit this place. There we go. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh. Hi, Starworm. Uh, I know you're not like much for words, but I would like to know what the heck is happening. Okay, no one told me, like, the the end, like, the last boss was gonna be Yumei <laughs> Yeah, I recognize the sword now. Yeah, Elro and oh, and yeah, wife and child in the background. Gosh, that's some like dang visuals in the house. Wait, what? If you say the right dialogue options to that party member throughout the game and max out their affection, there's ma there's affection? Oh, like here? Who's this? Amina. Really? Oh, because of the ancestors? so neat. Now we have the moon.
I'm assuming this is Royal, and Royal was kind of like not a big fan, or like probably didn't didn't say the best things for us. Jeez. I'm assuming the last person is black because Robin has like a giant headache during the fight. Oh my gosh, that's Robin? What? I mean, you heard, the world ends with me. Anywho. Not you. Come on. I fought so many of you. How many could there? Okay, no, there can be a lot because I remember seeing like the giant, huge, giant pile at the bottom of the pit. Hi, Orb. You're not the savior orb. You're a bad orb.
<laughs> Naughty car. Holy crap! <laughs> you almost drained the, the stoop. You almost drained the planet. What are you doing? Chozo's mad. I guess we're fighting the Chozo. Chozo, who's really mad, is like there's no more like ivory left in the planet. Just want to grab the heart. Thank you. Jeez. That's a wrench. Oh, right, right, because everything is like, has like nuts and you're not supposed to. The engineers of the world are kind of mad at us. All right. They're fighting Argus all of a sudden. Oh, hey, hey! Isn't that like the first boss fight music? Oh, geez, no, don't start up the big worm again! Heck yeah, nature!
Don't agitate the deer. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay, boom, I just read like you okay, Mina didn't come to help you at the end. Whoa. Hi, I'm back, save the world. Kitty <laughs> Oh, geez. Okay, so I'm I'm glad I I'm glad I got along with Mina then, because that was like an important part of the end, I think. Yeah, half court knitted. Over Bolvir. Ardy? Oh my gosh, Ardy. I'm Arby. Robin. Mina. Elro. Royal. Agent Black. General Chrome. Tolo. Yay! Oh, cool. They managed to, like, make other generators work. Samba, Polro. Captain Maron. Dr. Gustavo. Tegan! Minora, Hineta, Ella, Pontus, hope Pontus, okay. Petra, Chemico Contra, Petrocosa. Barton, who only has a top half, does not exist behind the counter. Benley, Mr. Andrus, right, Mr. Andrus. Thorn Thanny, who made it to the big city, I hope they're okay. Leticia? Oh, I remember Leticia. And pull up. The progenarian! Oh my gosh! He that's where he was. He was in the city. Agent White, the silver watchman. Ash, Agent Grey, Mother. Mother's Corners. Oh, that's an interesting. Mendeleev. <laughs> that's a good pose. I want that outfit. Novell, Lawrence. Emmett Darlin, Isling Ferrier, B a block rock, or B. B block rock, Oliver Shard, or Joseph Glass. Mr. Chad and Mr. Wink, whatever happened to Mr. Chad and Mr. Wink? You know, fell off the place of the earth. One concerned attacker, one concerned defender. Oedipus, Oedipus. Oedipus is such a good name for a cat. Oedipus. Zeneda, alternate me in this game. Ooh, Lori. Lore, who got kicked. Pete. Oh, yeah, Pete at the pearly gates. Oh, they're okay. They're okay. They're okay. Mm. Jeez, you made it, buddy.
Okay. Letitia's with a bonus boss. Oh my gosh, okay, the children are like not having a good time. Kathunk. Kibuka. Inti. The Kava. Assessed Thunk. The Omega Controller. Oh, just a blocker. All right. I mean, purple cowboy skeleton would have been cool. Star Worm and... Hmm? Who knows? Like on Jack. That, that crown reminds me eerily of Cave Story. Hey, yeah. Mm. Oh, interesting. Jojo just like... Hey, 11 hours, just under 11 hours. 70, made 70, 53 tweaks. Collected a bunch of components. Robin has headphones? Should I, should I make a new, say, new game plus file? Will that let me just save a different file so I can like keep unlocking stuff on the on the old one if I want to do the, the optional bosses. Okay. Black gets the cool file. Gosh, that was something. World record, 41 minutes. Gosh. <laughs> so this is a pretty cool game. That was an adventure. There were some frustrating bits, but I'm really glad I played it. And considering this is the work of primarily one person, like, good gosh. That is an achievement. Now I can just dip into the wiki and, like, see what people have, like, theory crafted about, like, the world and everything, but I, it is kind of interesting to have like, oh, this whole entire like religion thing built out of like, no, this was just somebody else's planet at some time and they come back and they're really angry that you kind of messed it up. Pretty late, because that's what happened. <laughs> Thank you so much, everyone, for dropping by and cheering me on. As I went through this game, this was a lot of fun. This was an adventure, and I'm glad I went on it. And now I can talk a lot more about it. Hmm. Say, so, oh, those are headphones. They're like, yeah, no. They're like, um, they're like, yeah, industrial grade, like, earmuffs, ear protectors. She works with machinery. She's a mechanic. That makes sense. I got it now. So yeah, thank you so much, everybody. Can't wait for the next adventure. It's gonna be pretty cool. <sighs> and until that time, please take care of yourselves, because you're worth it, and you deserve it. Don't need some higher power to tell you you're valid. Let's, let's have our own adventures. Be, be the heroes we want to be for ourselves. 
and you don't have to do a lot for that. You don't need to go save the world. You can just do your best every day. Or at least today. Sometimes you get tired. <sighs> so yeah. Thanks for being here. Thanks for sticking around. Keep on doing what you can. Because that's what we're going to do. We can't all be mechanics that can, like, rework the way the world works. But the cool thing is, we can have a tiny bit of influence, and that's amazing. Ah, I'm excited for what's next. So let's see each other next time. And until then, let's keep making wonderful things together. Bye-bye!